Hello, my love. Good morning to you. I hope that this finds you well. I hope that you have had a sip of something to drink today. I hope that you have time for this. I hope that your life is slow enough that you do not feel rushed and can sit back and take this in for a moment. Or if this is not your cup of tea, to take in something else at a leisurely pace. I am thinking about you as always. I was also... I was also thinking about how we act matters, or what we do matters. And in this I'm thinking about relationships. And in my life what I found was that, this is so obvious, it goes without saying, but what you do matters. How you act with other people will affect your relationship with them and whether there is indeed a relationship with them. And I bring this up because I found that there were certain people in my life that I would run into who would sort of take a, a bit of a bravado stance of take me as who I am, you know, take it or leave it and you can go pound sand if you don't like how I am. Which has its own benefits and, and there are things that are good about that sort of approach in terms of confidence and being comfortable with who you are and in terms of deciding not to change who you are and to just accept who you are. But in the same vein, I would find sometimes with those people that they would wonder then why perhaps I didn't call that often or why the relationship didn't continue. And it was because they would do things that I just did not find pleasant. And the point is, and this, people are, were more than free all throughout their lives to do things that I did not find pleasant. And I am sure that I did many things that others did not find pleasant. But the point is that they would then say things that made me think, oh, they don't realize that they're doing this thing that I find unpleasant. And there was a lack of awareness, I felt, in, on the part of some people. And so I... I bring up this, this theme of what you do matters because for me it was a good reminder to, to do a self-check. If people were not interacting with me with the way that I expected them to um, or they were declining to interact with me, it was a time for me to pause and reflect about how I had been acting and to wonder if there was anything I should change in myself, um, sort of a self-assessment. and. This is not to say that you should should become someone you are not and act a way that you are not comfortable with. I'm not talking about that, but I'm talking about kindness at the end of the day. Were you treating people with kindness? Were you considerate? Were you thoughtful? Did you listen? And these are the questions I would ask myself. Were I these things and was I doing something that was off-putting? in terms of that realm of behavior. So it was just, it was very helpful to me to, to sort of make that assessment because I found, especially with myself, I was not comfortable telling people about the things that they did that I did not like. And that's my own fault. That was a, a defect in my own character, quite frankly. And sometimes I was able to get up to gumption, and sometimes I was not. And then there's also the second question of whether they would change in the long run anyway. Um, but I'll leave that at the, at the, to the side for now. So, I guess that's, that's it in a nutshell. Stating the obvious, but be aware that what you do matters in your relationships and interactions with others. And with that, I will recommend again Illuvium and Shuffle Drones. Um, of course, the, the, the entire catalog is worth listening to, but, uh, but I'm focusing on things that I've just, I listened to in my life ad nauseum. Uh, and Shuffle Drones was one of those albums. Or recordings and with that I will say that I love you and I will bid you adieu.